Hey guys, you're watching Midalada TV. Today I want to show you how to powder coat lead bullets. In this particular case, I want to powder coat lead rifle bullets cast with the NOE mold. Normally, I would use the MCC method to color code these bullets here, but this bullet design comes with a very sharp tip. And with the MCC method, I can damage this tip, so I had to powder coat them. To do so, I built this uh, wood tray for a solid stand. Uh, nothing fancy, simple wood. I drilled some holes in it. And yeah, these holes have the same diameter like the gas check tank from the bullet. So all I have to do now is cover the whole uh, wood with a tin foil and then put the bullets in the holes. You can feel the drilled holes below the tin foil and all you have to do now is to push the bullets through the foil and I want to do so with the whole tray and then I switch the camera back on again. It took something between 5 and 10 minutes to complete the tray and now I'm ready to start with powder coating. I bought a simple powder coating gun on eBay. This model here, you know it at uh, Harbor Freight. I set the pressure at 30 psi and now I can start powder coating my bullets. For this I need maybe 30 seconds, I want to coat them from all four sides. If you powder coat things you should wear gloves, glasses and a mask. I preheat my oven at 180 degrees uh, Celsius. Now I can put my bullets in and it took maybe 15 minutes until they are finished. When the powder start melting down, I set my timer at 15 minutes. After the oven, I let cool them down for some seconds and then I remove them from the tray, resize them and see the gas check. And here are my finished powder coated rifle bullets. Next I have to figure out a good hand load and then I want to test accuracy. And that was my short video how to powder coat lead bullets. I hope you enjoyed this little video here. Please tell me what you think about powder coated bullets and share your experience if you already have some. Please click on the thumb up button below if you like this video and please subscribe to my channel if you do not already have. Thank you very much for taking your time watching my video. Hope to see you next at Vidalada TV.